in this video tutorial I am going to design this oil seal just uh, look at the drawings and we will just draw this uh, sketch this portion of this sketch and then we are going to revolve it about this axis so let's start it so go to sketch and make sure you will select the right plane for our sketching plane and the normal view is in front of us then go and draw center line for our reference and for the axis then select the line tool and just draw a profile I'm going to start it from here just here go here here line right there and right there right there right there right there right there right there, right there. I just draw this sketch and I am going to zoom it like that I'm going to select it here I am going we will add dimension later but just I am making it to similar to the given sketch now select the smart dimension and no here is a trick like if you want to add the half dimension like I selected this and then this line and the trick is that either I can add this half dimension or if I move my mouse button and move this dimension below that uh, point then it will add a full dimension you see it's 2.4 here if I move it here it's 4.8 now so I'm going to add the full dimensions and this dimension is 1.5 and basically when I will add this 1.5 it will move this uh, line below that sketch and it will like disturb our sketch so I just finish it first I'm going to add this dimension basically this dimension select this dimension this line and make sure you will add the full diameter dimension if I move it half here is double this is radius and this is diameter and this dimension is given as as diameter 0.985 and then I am going to select this line this line and make sure you you will add the full diameter dimension and this dimension is 1.095 okay and then I am going to add this dimension just move this line a little bit here I'm going to select this line and make the diameter dimension this dimension is given 1.2 and then I am going to select this line and this axis is already selected and this is 1.35 now I'm going to select this line the diameter dimension is given as 1.5 Okay, so if you zoom to fit, you will see the diameter dimension and add it. I'm just make it zoom it so it, it is like in a good position for us. Then I am going to select this line. Sorry, just unselect everything, select smart dimension, select this line and this line. This dimension is given as. 0 0.240 and it will little bit disturb our sketch because we draw this sketch very large I'm just taking it like that like that so drag different points to make it similar to the point or if you want to avoid for this confusion just add one line or two line add these dimension then add other line add the dimension like that you can do that or you just simply draw a sketch similar to the 
your profile and add the dimension if sketch will be like uh, seem to me like crazy just drag some points and make it similar to your sketch <coughs> And this dimension is given as from this point to this point this dimension is given as 0 0.08 okay and now I'm going to add a relation I'm going to select add relation I am going to select this point and this origin and make sure these two points are vertical to each other now this point is fixed with this origin I am not able to move this line because of this uh, vertical relation we added between this point and this origin now if you see I can drag and move it here so we needed to make this point and this point also horizontal or this line and this line collinear so I am going to select add relation I am going to select this line and this line and make them collinear collinear meaning these two lines are will be on the same line the points of this line will be on the same axis or same line and then add a dimension I am going to select now I am going to add a angle dimension I am going to select this line and this line and when I drag it here you can add a angle at different location but I am going to drag it here and add this angle 45 and this angle is also 45 let's see which dimension is left which we did not edit yet and this one to this this dimension is also given as 0.215 now which dimension is left Now we needed to add a circle on here and I am going to trim this lower portion of the circle and this right like that and this dimension is given as 0 0.04 radius. let me see which dimensions are left and this one is also 0 0.8 and this center is facing this point so I am going to add relation select this point and this point and make them a vertical so these two points must be vertical like on a vertical line these two points must be on a vertical line no our sketch is fully defined we don't need it any more dimension just click on the sketch fillet I am going to add fillet here and here for the fillet radius is 0 0.025 and select this one and this corner and we are all good and exit this sketch and go to normal menu make sure you selected this sketch and then select the devolve and the axis will be automatically selected and now our seal is done you can observe like that so it's uh, completed just add the material yes. Select material. now our oil seal is done 